It's getting juicy. It's Black Friday. Yo, most people save money on Black Friday, but we, we waste money. It's a shopping spree type of day. Too many cards came out. Too many bangers. Too many cards I know the Booyah Nation wants to see. Speaking of the Booyah Nation, what's up, YouTube? I'm your boy, Double A. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. We're back on that rich man of glory. And oh, 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 EA Sports has fixed my account. Hey, the competitive tab is now there. We are able to compete. If you guys want to see us compete, well, tomorrow, make sure to smash that big old thumbs up. Can this get 5,000 likes? Are you trying to see me compete? I competed back in FIFA 17. I took a lot of y'all with me. I vlogged it. If you want to see me compete in another pro tournament, hit that big old thumbs up so I see that support, baby. And your boy might just pull up. Now, Black Friday's here. There's a new Benzema flashback. And there's a lot of new cards. We are going on a shopping spree. I'm going to keep it a stack with y'all. A big shopping spree. One of the biggest shopping sprees of this FIFA. I've changed the team up around a little bit. We got Nkunku on the left. I'm not sure if he'll stay around just yet. Maybe Kessier or Fofana. But I got three empty spots and there's three new cards. Now, your boy's going to waste some coins here. I ain't going to be crazy. Oh, 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 I know 40% of y'all watching this right now are not subscribed. So what I'm going to need you to do is hit that big sub button right now. Go subscribe. Make sure to subscribe. We're going for 1,000 new subscribers today. Can we do it? Can we get 1,000 new subscribers right now, right, right now? Smash that subscribe button. Now, with that being said, let's get on the market. A lot of y'all out there right now want to see this new Ben Yedder. I know a lot of y'all out there right now want to see all these new signature cards. That's what exactly what we're going to do. First things first. First, we're going to jump on this brand new Atal signature card, all right? This new Atal. Akimi for me, is one of the best right backs, no, no doubt about it. Um, one of the best right backs in the game. But with this new signature signing promo that EA just dropped, I don't know, man. This Atal is looking kind of juicy. So we're going to go out, first of all, and pick up the brand new juicy Atal. Atal is looking clean. Wow, his price is mudded. He's actually not even expensive. And he's probably going to continue to go down, which is crazy. He'll probably eventually get close to the Hakimi price. Maybe he'll stay around here, to be honest. He might stay around here. But I'm, I'm telling you what, man. Looking at this card right now, I mean... I mean, he just looks too good to not try. So we're going to throw him in uh, if we can buy him. Can we buy him, please? There it is. One, uh, 118K. The brand new Atau is going directly into the mega team. And we're going to see what this card's all about. Shopping spree's not done there. Next man up. Who we going for next? You know who it is, bro. Oh, no. Oh, no. The most, the most disgusting card uh, of the last few years of FIFA. Probably the most overpowered card of the last few FIFAs. He must be around 900K, right? Now, nah, his price is slowly tanking, and he's going to continue to tank. I'm going to lose money here. 100% I'll lose money here. I'll lose money, but it's for the Booyah Nation. So, you know what? If we lose a little bit of money here, a little bit of money there, it's what we do for the Booyah Nation, baby. Uh, we're going to get up for... Nope. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. All right, boys. It ain't looking good, huh? Uh, nah, we could pick him up for 820 is the cheapest on the market. Again, this price is going to tank, all right? Lightning rounds are on their ways 100%. I don't know what his uh, pack weight is, but... I'm pretty sure this this uh this card will come down a lot. But you know what? Right now I just want to make sure I try him for the boys. Something I really want to do. He looks nasty. He looks so good. I can't wait to use him. Four-star skiller, five-star weak foot. You know what I'm saying? Five, seven, high, low, agility, 94, balance 94. We'll talk about all the goodies in a minute. We'll talk, we'll look at all these cards. But the last one up, and this one kind of hurts inside, man, just to look at it. Portugal will be pro, pro facing Turkey, which is not easy. And then after facing Turkey, they would have to beat Italy if they got by Turkey just to go to the World Cup. We may never see Chris. Cristiano Ronaldo in another World Cup. Crazy to think, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. Big boy Renato Sanchez's price tag is up there, but we got to bring him in. Renato is that guy. We all know that, man. Some of the most overpowered cards in all of FIFA have dropped today, so we got to make these moves, man. For 5-5, five, five, that's the cheapest on the market. You come with me, 555. Ladies and gentlemen, big boy Renatinho is now with us, man. Oh, the Benfica legend. I just love his smile. What a guy, man. You come with me. Now we got Renato. Now we got Atao. Now we got Ben Yedder. And the team is looking mighty juicy. I might make some more changes. I don't like my back line. I'm not the biggest fan. I'll be honest. I'm not the biggest fan of 
Marquinhos. And I know a lot of you are going to say, hey, just snatch up that Hakimi then. And that is a very big possibility and an answer, possibly. But I just don't know yet. I don't know. We're going to have to figure it out. I'm going to play around with it and see what we actually do and how we do it. But ladies and gentlemen, look at the squad, man. Look at the squad dub. Ooh, 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 it's looking good, boys. All right, big boy Atau. We put him, I mean, uh, Ben Yedda, we put him at cam, right? Let, let's get him on full, on full. We're going to look at that card some more in a minute, but his agility's nuts. We got Renato on full. What are we throwing on Renato? Maybe a, a, a shadow, right? A shadow on Renato. 87 pace, bro. I hadn't even looked at that. Nah, nah, we're going to look at all the cards in one minute. Throw a shadow on this boy right here. I don't even know what you throw on a towel because i mean dude his, his pace is already 96 what do you put do you throw an anchor just a cat i don't know sent i'm gonna throw a sentinel on him probably wrong thing to put on him but i'm gonna try that and then for ben yetter i think you gotta throw 100 to get the rest of his speed up so that's that's how it is bro our team is looking i mean mighty crazy i want to show you a few things let's look at these cards look how good they really are because they are really good let's be honest with each other um this team great can Pembe, would he fit um, I don't think so. Let's say I put Donnarumma. Okay, so he would be on eight. So I don't know if Kempembe actually fits. Kempembe fits if I get Hakimi. That's for sure. Um, I don't know, dude. I'm going to have to play around. I'm not the biggest fan of this Marquinhos card. I'm going to be honest with y'all, man. I rather I really want Ether Militao. But for that, I would have to get Mendy. If I swap this, I, I mean, I could... Ah, man, it's tough, man. Anyways, big shopping spree. The team looks absolutely disgustingly good. Ben Yedder's actually going to play up top, you know, with R9. That's where he's going to be. I'm going to jump into the 4-4-2. Um, we're going to have Neymar on the left and Kunku and my boy uh, Renato Sanchez down uh, the middle with Ben Yedder and R9 up top and Mbappe running a wing uh, with, um, with Neymar. And that's how the team is going to line up, bro. It's actually incredible. It's actually an incredible team. Yo, this is probably one of the dopest teams I've had in any FIFA. Like, Atal, Renato Sanchez, and Ben Yedder's card. Even in Kunku. Like, it's just dope-looking cards, bro. Like, they look so clean. Anyways, boys, we got to try this, man. We got to see what this team can do. So, let's go ahead and qualify for the weekend league, man. We got a match, boys. Oh, we got David Beckham. Ooh, here we go. Yo, I'm excited, bro. I can't wait to see what these players bring. Here we go. Oh, wow. Wow, oh, that felt quick. That, that gameplay fell quick right there. Okay. My boy and Kunku, we already know what he's all about. We ain't got to see nothing there. Big boy Neymar, nice. Renato, how's he feel? Oh, Renato's already good in this game, by the way. I was using his gold like two nights ago, and I was like, man, this card already feels insane. Like any upgrade, it's going to be on. This is the card that I'm most excited. Him and Ben Yedder, because I know Renato's going to. Ooh. Ooh, that's some juicy ball movement. I mean, uh, 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 dribbling. What the heck was that? Ice boost from Ben Yedder. Could have an open R9. Why not send it to him? R9 can't finish. That, to me, y'all, is mad. Because right there, Ben Yedder does everything right. Let me get Mbappe. I got Mbappe. I have Renato. Renato's on it. Renato shoots. Big save from Petr Cech, dude. I thought we were actually scoring there. Nice pass to Renato Sanchez. Oh, maybe a cheese goal? Nope. But ben, back down. Ben Yedder can finish. Misses. Ben Yedder misses again. Ben Yedder, he misses two. Now, is that Ben Yedder or is that FIFA 22? In my opinion, that's just FIFA 22, isn't it? Keepers up close make the dumbest of saves. That is just, just crazy, if you ask me. Oh, I couldn't step up. That's 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 tough. I couldn't step up. That's a goal. I could not step up there. Yeah, it was a counterattack. I couldn't step up. We probably should have scored, to be honest. And now... You know, we're losing, unfortunately. That's the way it goes. Tao. Into Mbappe. What a ball. Back post is Neymar. He jumps. He gets it. Neymar scores. It took 74 minutes to finally open this dude up. Yo, 4-1-2 and 2 narrow is very hard to break down, bro. Ah, it's very, very tough, man. I don't understand it. Um, So far, haven't really been able to see much of Ben Yedder, uh, unfortunately. I'm going to put De uh, Alfonso Davies into the middle and um, and bring in Salah as well. But yeah, with Neymar out on, I mean, with Mbappe on the right, on the wing, I, I don't know, man. I feel like he's kind of being a little bit forced out of the game, which is not good because he's one of the most important cards in this game. Um, so 
my judgment based off of Ben Yedder is not so much how great his card, but it's the positioning of where Mbappe needs to be. You know, you're never going to drop an R9 for Ben Yedder. So that's that's one thing. And then the only other guy you could possibly move out of the striker position is most like the only other one is um, Mbappe. But are you OK with moving an Mbappe just to have a Ben Yedder up top? That's where it becomes a very interesting conversation. Renato Sanchez chilling with it. Nice find to Theo Hernandez back into Renato, who is really, really good, man. He just, and yet, ah, I try to just boost right through that middle. Um, Renato just seems to be very hard to get off the ball, to be honest. Interception a lot as well. Nice, man. Yeah, I put Afonso Davies into the midfield for the second half of games a lot. Now I swing it out to Mbappe. Mbappe dances a little bit, finds Ben Yedder. Ben Yedder does find a way to control it. Gets by one, gets by two, takes the shot, and Ben Yedder scores. And now all of a sudden, Ben Yedder's first goal comes off of some nice dribble moves and a very nice near post shot past Petr Cech. An unbelievable shot, which now gives us the lead literally so quickly in this game. We were, the whole game, we couldn't find the back of the net. And the interesting thing is this, and y'all might laugh, but a second of having Mbappe more on the right-hand side, even though he was still out on the wing, he was in the box already. And then you saw what he was able to create to find Ben Yedder. No complaints. Team feels unbelievable. Um, it took a while for us to score, which is a, a little bit concerning. But when I look back at the game, 60% possession, 10 shots. We did nothing wrong, bro. There's nothing there that I would change or do differently. The team played remarkable. Everything about it was great. Um, there is one thing that I'm thinking, though. So as I look at this team... You're allowed in the competitive to play with 390 cards. Look at this team. Um, Mbappe's a 90, Neymar's a 90, which leaves a 90 spot open if we kept this team to bring in a Conte. Inform Conte Finn Kunku could be a thing with this team, which would be pretty crazy. All right, man, let's go quick, bro. I'm trying to get into the weekend league. I'm trying to qualify as quickly as possible. We got this game now. Let's see if we can hurry up and get through it and uh, get into this weekend league as quickly as possible. Let's see what this team can bring, bro. First game, okay, a little bit underwhelming, but still a pretty okay game from us. So we take that, but you want to see more. I know 60% possession, 10 shots, plus the win is a dub, but... I don't know. I wasn't impressed with the way we attacked, if you know if you know what I'm saying. We defended well, but I want to attack better. Let's go. Neymar, he just dribbled. Oh, okay, Neymar, I see what you're doing there. Just dribbling right through everybody. Here's Ben Yedder. Ben Yedder turns on the Jets. He ball rolls. Almost got by. Yo, come on now. Chill, bro. You almost got by Ben Yedder right there. Nice pass, Neymar. Renato Sanchez. What a ball into Ben Yedder. Left it to R9. Back of the net very quickly. I could have done a little twist there with Ben Yedder. Took the shot ourselves. But I'm not really trying to showcase how great Ben Yedder is. I'm trying to showcase a good team. You know what I mean? I want the team to play good football. Renato Sanchez led the way. Dominating the midfield as we knew he would. Get there, baby. Nice. Hits Ben Yedder this time. Ben Yedder. Ooh, I was going to turn on the Jets right there, bro. Let me tell you. Good interception. Let me try here. Oh, right there. I was putting a through pass into Ben Yedder. So not, not, not the last two possessions, just giving away possession too cheaply and not attacking well enough, taking him off the ball quickly. Can't get there again. But yeah, man, that, that was the definition of good footy right there. If you ask me, literally Renato Sanchez led the way, put a beautiful ball into, was he offside by, the, by any chance? I guess not. Renato Sanchez led the way beautifully and then. We found a nice pass into Ben Yedder and a very nice Tiki Taka pass into R9. So that's exactly what, you know, you want to see from your front two. Connecting well. Nice ball to my boy, uh, Neymar, swinging it all the way down to Mbappe for him to control and keep in. He does. Find Now Ben Yedder, ah, the pass up almost worked. Waiting with it, waiting with it. Ben Yedder, once again, no. I probably had a shot. I do that too much in this FIFA, by the way. I always look for the pass one more time. Maybe I need to just take the near post shot more often um but i'm always looking for the pass up and i, I think that really costs us a lot a towel versus fakir can't get there renato can he get in front of pugba can't right there good shot ars we move i want ben yetter will he make a run ben yetter why is he not making the run 
Should I go over the top to Ben Yedder? Nah, 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 nah. That's just giving possession away. Let's be smart. Go Renato Sanchez. What a ball to R9. Renato cut. I mean, R9 cuts. Finesses. Back of the net. Renato Sanchez, man. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. He's hold it, man. He's, he's, it, it's hold it. His cards, hold, that's hold it, man. That's hold it. That, that card's going to be in everybody's team, bro. Renato Sanchez is by far that guy this year. Oh, man. It's crazy. Nah, it's Matt. He intercepts everything, bro. His passing's good. He's fast. It, it's literally everything you need in a center mid. Box to box. I was going to, R, to Neymar right there. Yeah, he's been crazy. Here's Ben Yedder. Try to get a nice little assist. Whip this ball into the back post. R9's there. The header's there. Easy, cheeky goal and assist for Ben Yedder. Two assists for Ben Yedder. Couple goals for R9. This game felt better. This game felt more controlled. I know I had 60% possession last game, but this game felt way more controlled, man. Way more like we were on top of it the entire time. Stats led better on the other game, but... I don't know. I felt like we did everything right this time. This guy has the new flashback, Benzema. Ben Yedder. Finds Renato. Back into Ben Yedder. Cuts. Finesses. Crossbar and out. Maybe that was the post. Yo, I thought I did it with Ben Yedder right there, bro. I really thought I got it. That's tough. I thought he hit the back of the net, bro. I really thought he hit. That was a left-footed shot as well. It bent beautifully. Man, that was a good attempt from Ben Yedder. We finally gave him space to be able to see what he could do. Now, I've been thinking, could Ben Yedder possibly run a wing? Now, I know a lot of y'all going to be like, wait, 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 what'd you say? But, I mean, when you really think about it, his speed is kind of around the same as, oh, nice move from Ben Yedder there. Nice move from Ben Yedder there. On his right foot, he shoots. Donnarumma, did he move keeper? I think he might have moved keeper. I'm not 100% sure. But did he move keeper? Was that a near post shot? Did I take that shot wrong? A towel stepping up. Doesn't get there. Dribbling with Fakir. Some nice dribbling. And Fofana saying, hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Not today, buddy. Not today, buddy. My boy Mbappe swung in towards R9. R9 dribbles. Ben Yedder's there. And there it is. 1-0 for my boy Ben Yedder. He was everywhere that you wanted him. He's gone. We're into the weekend league. One of those things where I look at it and I think to myself, hey, can Ben Yedder run the wing? Because Messi also only has 60, you know, doesn't have crazy speed. Could Ben Yedder maybe run the wing? But then would you want Ben Yedder running the wing as a high low? He did pretty good as a striker. Three games, two goals, two assists. Like, can you ask for much more, especially when you play with R9? It's just about the movement of Mbappe. Moving Mbappe out to you know, a different out to a wing, it, it kind of feels a little bit, okay, am I wasting Mbappe here? Do I want to waste Mbappe here? But Ben Yedder did everything right. So 20 games of Ben Yedder at Strikers, what's going to decide it for me? Follow me on Twitter, on Instagram, even on the, on, 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 I'll throw it up on the TikTok as well. So you can find out if I think this Ben Yedder card is good or bad because um, I'm going to play the 20 games with him of Weekend League and we're going to see what he does. And I'll keep everybody informed, man. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching this episode of a spending spree for the best team in FIFA. Crazy, like 30 million coin team. But hey, man, it's 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 a crazy, awesome, fun team. And we might play competitive week of FIFA tomorrow with it. So, hey, hope you guys enjoyed it, man. Oh, yeah, we out of here.